the next question is what's been happening so far for this ship? No. <laughs> she fucked me up. <laughs> we'll get there. Alright guys, so today we are down at the beach because we decided to not be over the top boring and do a video at home. We're not so fucking lame, so we, we wanted to spice it up. We've decided to come down to the beach for a bit of a change of scenery. Um, at the moment we're having to record on Ashley's phone inside of my shoe. It's the only way that we can set the camera up properly because I've got the camera right beside us here doing a time lapse. So we'll put in the end of this video. So hopefully that's going to be nice. It'll be uh, sun going down. But we decided to uh, <clears throat> bring you guys down here today with us because we wanted to do a video. You're like a child playing with sand. We wanted to do a video just to sit down and actually talk about why we stopped YouTube for so long. And I know previously our videos weren't exactly, you know, every week. They're more like every month. But if not every year. <laughs> but we just had this massive gap for like six, seven months where we didn't post. So we wanted to jump on and basically let you guys know why we stopped for so long. Yeah, so what was the first question we had? It why was we why we stopped for so long. So we're just gonna go in and answer that. So I feel like the reason that we both <clears throat> stopped YouTube for quite a while was because work was getting a bit chaotic. I feel like I was working quite a lot at that point in time and it was just very stressful and I just, I guess, couldn't be bothered to do a video. Um, if not, just kind of lost a lot of motivation to do YouTube. Um, now, if you guys don't know, we haven't really recorded anywhere else, anywhere else out of the house, except for maybe in the car or something like that, where not a lot of people can hear us or anything like that. So it's a big step out of my... Uh... ...comfort zone to be able to record down here at the beach where people can listen to us and there is a shitload of people walking past so I'm kind of nervous. You're fine. I'm a show pony so I don't care. Like this stuff doesn't bother me. <laughs> We're getting there. Oh, well, I'm getting there. That's okay. Step by step. So, um, <clears throat> but yeah, I definitely think work was probably the main reason as to why we stopped YouTube for quite a while. Um, Ashley's obviously having to juggle full-time uni with working casual to part-time, uh, casual to full-time in mental care. Yeah, as for me, exact same, I just lost a lot of motion. Uh, motion? I lost a lot of motion. Yeah. I lost a lot of motivation to, yeah, start filming and everything. Between work, like, I'm contracted permanent part-time, but sometimes my hours differ from 12 hours a day to I have sleepovers and everything as well with clients, so... It is quite full on at times and yeah, I come home and even if I have the weekend off, I just don't have the motivation to do a video. Um, <coughs> yeah, so I'm basically working full-time hours and full-time uni, which is really stressful for me. But I have one year left and, you know, hopefully we can be more consistent of when we're filming, we have quite a few big plans and whatnot. Um, but yeah, life's just hectic and it got in the way. I think we definitely, and it, like Noah's spoken to me about this before and he just said, like, I don't think we were ready for that step and that commitment to YouTube just yet. Um, but... I mean, not like we are now, but, <clears throat> you know, we're, we're still... I think we're just on the road to... Figuring get, it out. Yeah, and getting there, um, I guess, within our YouTube career. Yeah. Well... Hey. <laughs> but... Yeah, I definitely think that 2021 is definitely going to be a better year for us, even though we've started in, what, fucking March? Gen yeah. January, March. Yeah, she right? started off a shit May. show. In May, sorry. But... So, we uploaded our first video, like, a few days ago in May. Um, so, we've started 2020 quite late, but we have so many ideas as to what content we're going to do and how we're going to attack them and how we're going to pursue them. So, I feel like this year is definitely going to be a lot more consistent with our videos. And, I mean, I guess regardless of the fact... Um, we are hoping to, um... <laughs> Spit your words out! Yeah, I, I, I have no words, I'm just, you know, if you guys have subscribed to us or you are, or, or you are going to subscribe, ah, or you are going to subscribe to our channel, you know, enjoy the ride, I guess, because you're in it just as much as we are. Yeah. And we are so grateful for, you know, those people who have supported us so far. I know we're only small and starting off, but... 
yeah, it's still such a big step. And for someone to have the idea of, okay, hey, let's start a YouTube channel, like... It takes a, take a lot of balls. It ha- yeah. And we've heard a lot of big YouTubers say that. Um, but, yeah, we decided to do it. And although, like we said before, we haven't been super consistent, we think this year is going to be a better year. And, yeah, how's that time lapse going? Yeah, just playing around with it. He's just fixing up the time lapse. So the show's all about me now. So the next question is what's been happening this year for us so far. And you know what? Not a lot. It's been shit. This year so far has been probably one of the worst years. Because Ashley is in her last year, or yeah, last year of her nursing degree, I guess anyone that's done nursing and or has been a partner that has supported their partner. <laughs> Sorry, has been a partner of someone that is doing a nursing degree will understand how stressful it is on that person um, to be able to get through the last year of their, of their uni. Um, and I can see it definitely takes a toll on, on Ashley herself. And obviously I've just got to be there to comfort her and help her through it. And yeah. Do it then. <laughs> All right. <laughs> um, exciting things for me that has happened so far this year is... I'm Guys, bl- sorry, I'm going to cut you off. When you say that kind of banter, do not think that we hate each other because we don't. We joke around all the time and he's really harsh to me off camera. <laughs> so I'm going to be harsh to him on camera. We're going to put it on camera very soon anyway. So. Yeah. All right, sorry, you go. Um, exciting things that have happened so far for me this year is I bought a new car so i bought a 2007v commodore um definitely a step up from the last car that i had which was a 2002 mitsubishi lancer um, that was a sex bomb <clears throat> love that car it was very uh, hard to get rid of it but got 50 bucks from the wreckers so can't complain um but yeah onto the new car and definitely like to do some i guess some automotive videos later on down the track so where i end up doing some modifications to the car um, and I guess running these guys through on if I do it myself as to how easy it is, how cheap you can do it and all that sort of stuff. I'm not one of them people that is, you know, I'm not going to sit here and make out that I know what the fuck I'm doing when I don't. So, I yeah. think for that one we'll actually do a series. So we'll just do like a series for like Noah's car and everything like that and, you know, for the people who do want to watch it. And then I'm sure there's going to be some people who don't. So, oh, yeah, I'm just saying. Exactly. There's, <laughs> so we'll just make a little series of Noah's car modifications and, you know, the work that he's doing over it. And he can just take you through. And did you just say you're no car expert? I'm no car expert, <laughs> so I'm not going to sit here and, and make out like I am. I'm just going to be here to, I guess, help out anyone else that is, I guess, sort of new to the car world. And, um, it's like learning along the way. Yeah, wants to know cheap and easy modifications to do on a VE Commodore, so, you know? Yeah. Um, <clears throat> You've been really into photography? I have been really into photography lately, so obviously using the Canon M50, which is our vlogging camera. Um, I feel like... Now, and again, I'm no photography expert, so I'm not going to sit here and make out like I know everything about a camera when I absolutely don't. But I've been playing around with it and watching a lot of uh, videos on YouTube. And the three photographers that I follow is North Borders, Seventh Era, and Hayden Pedersen. Um, Shout out. So I definitely love watching them three on YouTube and learning uh, how to use a camera, you know, and what sort of stuff that goes into that. Um, so I'll, I'm more than happy to drop a few photos at the end of this video to, to show you, I guess, what I have come up with so far. I'll put the befores and the afters of me, you know, how the photo was taken and then after I've edited it, um, just to give you a better insight on what I've done so far with photography. Um, we did want to mention, because we've tried to do this video before, um, it didn't turn out that great, so we're now here doing it again. Um, but I did, uh, I did mention in the first take that we tried to do in this video that I am this close to becoming fully qualified at my job. But in the video that we tried to attempt at this one, which was like three days ago, yeah. I'm, I had like five things to do. I have one thing left to do and I'm then fully qualified at my job, which I'm super stoked and super excited for. And I'm very proud of him. So I'll go fuck myself then. 
<laughs> Thank you. <laughs> so fingers crossed, I will be fully qualified at my job by the end of this week. Um, my boss has told me that my next webinar, which will be with the CEO of Mr. Minute, um, should be next Monday. So I'll keep you guys updated and on the next video, we'll uh, definitely let you know whether I'm there or not. Because um, the next video we'll be doing There's is... There's a bug flying around this screen. Yeah, it's a mosquito. Kill it. Got it. Got it. <laughs> Awesome. So next Tuesday we'll be doing an next video. So today is Tuesday. So next Tuesday, mm, yes. um, in a week's time, we will um, be doing another video. And fingers crossed, uh, I will be fully qualified at my job. Yay. So if you ever come to Harvey Bay and you need some shoe repairs, key cutting, engraving, or watch repairs done, you make sure you come see this guy. I'll sort you out. Only if you let me know that you know me by my YouTube channel. <laughs> our YouTube channel. <laughs> um, <clears throat> and the third question, third and final question is, is, <laughs> is, what's exciting to come this drum year? Drum roll, yeah, what's exciting to come this year? I feel like we've just answered that all in there. Um, we're missing one crucial part. Yeah, yeah. We are going to Gold Coast in July. Oh, we are too. Um, so excited as, Everyone in the friggin' world should know this whole COVID has just messed everyone over and you can't travel overseas and this and that and whatnot. Um, but yeah, we're going down to Gold Coast, which is about four, five hours away from us. No, it's like, yeah, like four. Yeah, four hours. About four and a half, yeah. Um, hours away <clears> from <throat> us. And we're going down there with some of our friends from Mackay, which we are so excited for. So we have our whole trip planned and... We'll be doing a few videos while we're down there. So I think yeah. we're there for four days in total. So we'll be doing uh, two videos over the time yeah. we're down there, which will, the first video will be day one and day two, and then the second video will be day three and day four. I hope they're fun, and I hope you guys enjoy them and something out of the ordinary for us, because we don't, we haven't ever actually in a video, like been vlogging around town or vlogging a holiday or, I mean, we had the Sunshine Coast, but we didn't really and, vlog yeah, down there. And we had Mackay as well, but that wasn't over the top yeah. fantastic at all. So we definitely feel like we're gonna do a lot better in the Gold Coast video when we're yeah. down there. So make sure you stay tuned for that because that is in July and we are now in May. And it'll be really um, fun. So um, it's very, very soon. Going with friends as well. Definitely. We're excited for that. Um, there is one more exciting thing that might be happening for you this year. I might be getting a new car, guys. So, um. <laughs> At the moment, as everyone knows, she owns a 2006 RAV4 with coilovers. <laughs> Actually, no, you just won't know that until the next video. Don't worry. Oh, we filmed yeah. three videos. Yeah. This is our third video we filmed today. So we are like drained. Yeah, by the way, tired. when you do watch this video, the next two after this, we've literally recorded three in the one day. Yeah. That's why we have not changed clothes. Yeah. We do have <laughs> a washing machine, but it's just been one whole day that we filmed three videos in. Um, I might be getting a new car. As Noah said, I have a 2006, <clears throat> I think, RAV4. With coilovers. With coilovers. <laughs> but, um,. <laughs> No, she doesn't. I'm just joking. But, um... <clears throat> what? You just lost my track of thought now. But you might be getting a new car. So, yes, I might be getting a new car at the end of the year. I'm so excited to get that. I still have no idea what I'm going to get. Um, at the moment, there's, like, nothing majorly wrong with my car. But um, I just think it's time for an upgrade. And I would like to get a full drive. Because um, Noah has his Commodore, so that's just an around town, you know, holiday, whatever kind of car. And then if we want to go to Rainbow Beach or, you know, down the beach or something like that, we'll take the ute before we're Or Fraser. Or Fraser, that'll be fun for a day trip or an overnight trip. Definitely. I'll make it luck for you for you to stay in the resorts, hey? Not with we're, the dingoes. We're, um, we're a bit, un well, Ashley's, I guess this is a wee thing. But regardless of the facts, we're, we're undecided on what car she's going to get yet. So if anyone has any recommendations, make sure you drop a comment. And let us know what, what four-wheel drive you would yeah. go. Um, well, obviously, we're not going brand new, so we'll be second-hand. And we do have a budget. I don't want the car to be super old. Although I'm getting it <coughs> second-hand, I still want it to be like 2015 or above. I don't Because I want this car to last me quite a while. And I'm still undecided as well. Just splitting this out there and let you guys know. I'm still undecided whether I just get this car at the end of the year or wait until I'm a fully qualified nurse and just go buy a brand new car. But the only reason I'm really thinking of getting a second-hand four-wheel drive is because I'm probably going to 
mess it up and hit a tree or something because it's my first four wheel drive and I probably have no idea how to drive the thing in sand or anything. So um, that's why I'm thinking I'll just go a second hand four wheel drive. Something new, but you know, not, not. Something not too new, but nothing too old. Yes. We do have a budget, but if you do have a recommendation on a four wheel drive, that is nice. Make sure you drop a comment, let us know. Yeah. Um, and I think. It's my birthday soon. It is too. Make sure you stay around and hang around for that vlog because I definitely want to do like a, a birthday slash birthday week for Ashley because her birthday is in like two weeks. So. It's next Thursday. Oh, it is too. Yeah, that's <laughs> technically two weeks. Um, so yeah, make sure you hang around for that so you can see what I bought her because I'm broke as shit, so don't expect a lot. And um, yeah. I told him I don't expect anything. Oh yeah, make sure you hang around for that one because I want to be a good one as well. I think that brings us to the end of this video. Yes. Um, I, and obviously, because uh, we have the time lapse there, we will uh, drop that at the end of this video. Obviously these videos, these sit down videos aren't as fun as our challenges or anything like that, but we just wanted to sit down and with you guys and actually let you know what's been going on because we were out for so long like out of youtube and everything like that <clears throat> and we just wanted to give you guys a bit of an explanation an update of to why that is but i feel like our mindset around the whole youtube and growing together not just on youtube but as a couple has changed completely um like both of us have grown a lot personally as well as together so both of us is that is that the right word <laughs> I can't English right now, I'm so tired. Um, yeah, we have grown a lot, so we're hoping that this is a better and bigger comeback for you guys. And we hope you enjoyed this video. So yeah, that brings us to the conclusion of the video. So if you guys enjoyed, make sure you hit the like button, the subscribe button, drop a comment, you know, do all them things. Hit all the buttons. Exactly. As for that, we will see you next time.